According to the most recent Gallup poll, bipartisan support, the hallmark of the U.S.-Israel special relationship, is in danger. Democrats and political independence sympathy for Palestinians has grown exponentially, reaching a new high. The gap between Democrat and Republican sympathies widened more emphatically in the last five years. Overall, the sympathy gap is at its apex with respect to liberal Democrats, 20% of whom sympathize with Israelis and 52% sympathize with Palestinians. It's worth noting that the increased sympathy for Palestinians among Democrats appears to stem from an assessment of the political situation on the ground, which clearly shows Palestinians living under Israeli oppression and apartheid. Ultimately, the sympathy of Democrats is generally moving in the pro-Palestinian direction. From 2002 through 2014, Democrats were significantly more likely to side with the Israelis than the Palestinians. Since 2014, that preference has gradually faded, and now Democrats generally are about equally likely to sympathize with Palestinians as with Israelis, and liberal Democrats have fully crossed the threshold. As of 2021, liberal Democrats sympathize more with Palestinians. According to Pew Research Center, even among Jewish Americans, there is a gap between Republicans and Democrats. About 72% or 7 in 10 Jewish Republicans and Republican-leaning independents say they are very or somewhat attached to Israel, compared with about 52% of Democrats and Democratic-leaning Jews. Also, younger Jews are less attached to Israel than their older counterparts. 67% of Jews ages 65 and older say they are very or somewhat emotionally attached to Israel, compared with 48% of those ages 18 to 29. In terms of the best possible outcome for resolving the conflict, only about 35% support the oft-touted two-state solution. And again, here age is a factor. Older Americans are more inclined to say that a two-state solution would be the best possible outcome. It was also found that young adults are less inclined than their elders to view the Israeli government favorably. Even American evangelical Protestants, who are among Israel's strongest and most loyal advocates, younger evangelical support appears to be declining. A 2018 and 2021 poll focusing exclusively on evangelicals ages 18 to 29 found that support for Israel among young evangelicals dropped from 69% to 34% during the three-year period. Younger evangelicals are viewing Israel as an oppressive nation on the wrong side of human rights and social justice. The shift in public opinion is apparent, which is partly why a group of former advertising professionals set out to sell Israel to Americans and formed Brand Israel Group. With regard to American demographics, two surveys were commissioned in 2010 and 2016. High favorability towards Israel was found among men, Republicans, and older Americans, whereas less favorability was found among women, Democrats, college students, and millennials, along with other marginalized groups, namely African Americans and Latinos. The message is clear. More and more Americans don't believe Israel shares their values, and the more Americans learn about Israel, the less they like it.